In a game of attacking football, particularly from Harper's, Hazinho Solomon converted both goals for the victors to push his season haul to 10. After a player was brought down, the striker slotted home a penalty in the 30th minute. Solomon made it 2-0 in the 62nd by capitalizing on a deflection of goalkeeper Omari Spence Joseph. Harper's, sponsored by Cool and Smooth and AC Delco and Gonthrop's Water, pulled one back in the 80th minute via Tamale Ziggy Thomas but Empire held on. In addition to a spate of missed chances, the title holders had the misfortune of their first red card of the season. Jumoy Stevens was sent off in added time for serious fall play. The result left Hoppers on 38 points and lifted Empire to 29 with two games to go. Earlier, Grenades, another team in contention for the runners-up spot and the Champions Cup, built on their 2-0 initial success by trouncing relegated Five Islands. Four goals to one. Zacchaeus Polius enjoyed a brace, and there was support from Damien Herewood and Kyle Edwards. All this followed the game's opening strike by Five Islands' Daniel Calvi in the 27th. Grenades, who netted three times in the second half, jumped to second spot on 30 points, while Five Islands' slim hopes of staying up in the top flight vanished. 24 hours earlier, the league's chief marksman, Tavon Peterette Harriet, earned Asset Sarkade Parama 1 0 win over troubled Fort Road. Harriet's 16th effort of the season came in the 27th from a set piece to propel Parham to 27 points. Also, Otters Rangers recovered from a goal down at the interval to beat Lime Old Road 2 1 on target with Junior Benjamin in the 48th and Jaquil Carr in the 73rd. Andre Brown had shot Old Road in front in the 42nd. Rangers climb to 18 points and closer to safety. This is Andre Henry reporting for ABS Sports.